Just over a day after blasting off, a SpaceX crew capsule arrived at the International Space Station on Sunday, delivering the replacements for NASA's two stranded astronauts. The four newcomers, representing the US, Japan, and Russia, will spend the next few days learning the station's ins and outs from Butch Wilmore and Suni Williams. Then, the two astronauts will board their own SpaceX capsule, which has been docked at the station since last year, to complete an unexpectedly extended mission that began last June. Wilmore and Williams initially expected to be gone for just a week when they launched on Boeing's first astronaut flight. However, they hit the nine-month mark earlier this month. The Boeing Starliner capsule encountered so many issues that NASA decided to bring it back empty, leaving the test pilots behind to wait for a SpaceX ride back. While the seven space station residents prepared for the newcomer's arrival, one of the Russian cosmonauts, Ivan Wagner, briefly put on an alien mask in a light-hearted moment. Wilmore opened the space station hatch and rang the ship's bell as the new crew members floated in one by one, greeted with hugs and handshakes. It was a wonderful day. Great to see our friends arrive, Williams told Mission Control. Wilmore's and Williams's ride arrived back in late September with a downsized crew of two and two empty seats reserved for the return journey. However, further delays occurred when their replacement's brand new capsule required extensive battery repairs. An older capsule was substituted, pushing their return date to mid-March. Weather permitting, the SpaceX capsule carrying Wilmore, Williams, and two other astronauts will undock from the space station no earlier than Wednesday and splash down off Florida's coast. Until then, there will be 11 people aboard the orbiting lab, representing the US, Russia, and Japan.